And what will the National Guard be doing? The National Guard is going to allow us, with as much damage as we have here, and as many businesses both here and in downtown Los Angeles, and the uncertainty about just how extensive this activity is going to continue, it's going to allow us to hold on the ground and post those National Guards to secure locations. As you've seen here today, we go to locations, we secure it, we even make arrests, and then only they have to come back to the location because others come in behind us. So this is going to allow us to hold ground at, at, uh, at hundreds of locations and we'll, without taxing our police resources, which will allow us to go out and, and ensure the safety of communities. My message tonight to Angelinos is work with us. Uh, encourage us to find ways as a, as a community uh, to go through this discord in a manner that's peaceful, in a manner that may be uh, you know, unfiltered, but doesn't involve violence and doesn't involve uh, the, the type of, of that destruction we're seeing around us. I'm sad. I'm, I'm, I'm heartbroken. This is, uh, I've lived through this before. Uh, it's been in this department for 38 years. And I prayed that we'd never be back in this type of situation. And LA has in such a different place than it was 30 years ago. And we've made so much progress as a, as a community, as a society, as a police department. We're not anywhere near the police department we were then. We did good work back then. We also made mistakes. And the same should be said for today. We're not perfect. Uh, but to see us fall back this far, uh, it hurts. It hurts a great deal.